Here is the synopsis for Southeast California, Southwest, and South Central Arizona. A potent weather system will move into the region Friday bringing widespread moderate rainfall and possibly a few isolated thunderstorms. The peak of a rain event will impact the western deserts starting Friday early morning, then shifting into south central Arizona later in the morning through early evening potentially creating issues for holiday travel. Lingering scattered showers are likely to redevelop across south central Arizona Saturday. Temperatures will quickly retreat to near or slightly below normal levels through the first half of next week. Here is the latest forecast. For the following area, in Arizona, Yuma, issued at 5.07 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Flood watch in effect from midnight Mountain Standard Time tonight through Friday evening. Tonight, mostly clear in the evening, then mostly cloudy with showers and a slight chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Heavy rainfall after midnight. Not as cool. Lows 53 to 56. Southeast wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of rain 90%. Rainfall up to a half of an inch possible, except locally higher in thunderstorms. Friday, showers and a slight chance of thunderstorms in the morning, then showers and a chance of thunderstorms in the afternoon. Heavy rainfall possible. Locally heavy rain possible in the afternoon. Cooler. Highs near 64. East wind 5 to 15 miles per hour. Chance of rain 90%. Rainfall over an inch possible, except locally higher in thunderstorms. Friday night, cloudy. A chance of showers and thunderstorms in the evening, then a chance of showers and a slight chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Heavy rainfall in the evening. Lows 50 to 53. Northwest wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of rain 50%. Rainfall less than a quarter of an inch, except locally higher in thunderstorms. Saturday, partly sunny with a slight chance of showers. Highs near 68. Southwest wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of rain 20%. Saturday night, mostly clear. Lows 47 to 50. South wind around 5 miles per hour in the evening becoming southeast after midnight. Sunday, partly sunny in the morning then becoming sunny. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. Sunday night, mostly clear. Lows 41 to 48. Christmas day, mostly sunny. Highs in the 60s. Monday night, mostly clear. Lows 40 to 46. Tuesday, mostly sunny. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. Tuesday night, partly cloudy. Lows 40 to 46. Wednesday, partly sunny. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. Wednesday night, partly cloudy. Lows 41 to 48. Thursday, partly cloudy. Highs in the mid to upper 60s. The Yuma, Arizona climate summary for this evening, as of 5 p.m., December 21st, 2023. Today's high temperature was 74 degrees. The normal high is 67. The record high is 80 degrees, which was last set in 1955. Today's low temperature was 53 degrees. The normal low is 46. The record low is 28 degrees, which was set in 1968. No precipitation fell today, which leaves the monthly total at 0.00 inches. The total precipitation for the year still stands at 2.62 inches. The normal high temperature for tomorrow is 67 degrees, and the normal low is 46. Sunset tonight is at 5.37 p.m. Sunrise tomorrow is at 7.37 a.m. The Imperial California Climate Summary for this evening, as of 5 p.m., December 21st, 2023. Today's high temperature was 69 degrees. The normal high is 68. The record high is 81 degrees, which was last set in 1950. Today's low temperature was 48 degrees. The normal low is 41. 
The record low is 27 degrees, which was set in 1968. The normal high temperature for tomorrow is 68 degrees, and the normal low is 41. Sunset tonight is at 4.40 p.m. Sunrise tomorrow is at 6.41 a.m. Flood watch remains in effect from midnight Mountain Standard Time, or 11 p.m. Pacific Standard Time tonight through Friday evening. What flooding caused by excessive rainfall will be possible? Where, Southeast California and far Southwest Arizona when, from midnight Mountain Standard Time, or 11 p.m. Pacific Standard Time tonight through Friday evening? Impacts, excessive runoff may result in flooding of rivers, creeks, streams, and other low-lying and flood-prone locations. Additional details, widespread rainfall with isolated thunderstorms will occur Friday. Moderate. Rainfall can be expected at times with total rainfall amounts averaging between 0.75 inches to 1.25 across the watch area with locally higher amounts in thunderstorm. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood you should monitor later forecast and be prepared to take action should flash flood warnings be issued. Flood watch remains in effect from Friday morning through late Friday night. What flooding caused by excessive rainfall will be possible? Where southwest and south central Arizona when from Friday morning through late Friday night? Impacts excessive runoff may result in flooding of rivers, creeks, streams, and other low-lying and flood-prone locations. Additional details, widespread rainfall with a couple isolated thunderstorms will occur Friday. Moderate. Rainfall can be expected at times with total rainfall amounts averaging between 0.75 inches to 1.50 across the watch area. Locally higher amounts of 1.50-2.00 are possible across higher terrain of Maricopa and Hilo counties. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood you should monitor later forecasts and be prepared to take action should flash flood warnings be issued. You are listening to National Weather Service NOAA Weather Radio WXL87 in Yuma, Arizona, serving Southeast California and Southwest Arizona. The current time is 5.42 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Here are the 5 p.m. Mountain Standard Time observations for the Yuma and Imperial County areas on Thursday, December 21st. At Yuma, it was mostly cloudy. Visibility 10 miles. Temperature was 73 degrees, dew point 51, relative humidity 46%. Wind was south at 8 miles an hour. And the pressure was 29.96 inches and steady. At Imperial, it was fair. Visibility 10 miles. Temperature was 68 degrees, dew point 56, relative humidity 65%. Wind was south at 3 miles an hour, and the pressure was 29.95 inches and steady. At El Centro, it was mostly cloudy. Visibility 10 miles. Temperature was 69 degrees, dew point 57, relative humidity 65%. Wind was calm, and the pressure was 29.97 inches and steady. Observations for Northern Arizona, at Bullhead City, it was clear, with a temperature of 72. At Flagstaff, it was mostly cloudy, with a temperature of 42. At Cholo, it was cloudy, with a temperature of 52. It was fair, with a temperature of 62 at Kingman, 42 at the Grand Canyon, 56 at Pres and 55 at Payson. Under fair skies, Page reported 51, Winslow reported 49, and Window Rock reported 45. Observations for Southern Arizona, it was fair. It was 77 at Phoenix, 75 at Tucson, and 68 at Nogales. Sierra Vista reported 66, Douglas reported 65, and Safford reported 65. 
regional observations, it was mostly cloudy, with a temperature of 64 at Los Angeles Airport, 66 at San Diego, 70 at Palm Springs, and 67 at Las Vegas. It was fair, with a temperature of 68 at Thermal, 72 at Blythe, and 49 at Albuquerque. At downtown Los Angeles, the weather conditions were not available, 